Hey everyone, Coder Steve here. In this video, I'm going to show you another little add on for the referral script. Um, someone commented on one of my videos. So I'll have a look at the comment now and I'll show you what it said. Go to my comments. Apply. Have a look. It said, Hi, sir. Very nice tutorial. I was actually looking for it, sir. Please make a video on two or more level ref referral system like multi-level marketing system so i've edited the code and i'll show you what i've done the aquat ideas um i'll show you what i've done so you can actually view uh, other referrals and what they've referred etc so let's go and have a look i mean i can do probably do a, a really advanced version of this but that would take some time to do and at this stage i'm trying to grow this channel to get subscribers so if anyone's new here and they're watching this video, please like and subscribe because if I can get a decent amount of subscribers, it will it will encourage me to produce more good quality videos around PHP and coding. So let's have a look what I've done. So I'll go to the website and that's the website. So I'll go to the page where we can log in. Firstly, login system for PHP. So what I've done in here is I've empty, emptied the user's table completely so we can start afresh and I can show you how it works. So it's completely emptied. So if we go and register a new user first, and I'll be the, the main user, Coder Steve, we'll go back to the website and I'll register just here. Coder Steve, now register an account. My ID is number one. So I'll log in. Now log in again and log into your account. Now I've got my referral URL. So if some uh, any anyone else is watching this, I've changed this bit here from index.php to login system.php. That's purely because the index page a uh, home page of my website doesn't actually contain the login box that's the only reason i've done that any questions or comments please comment in the box below it, it says you have referred zero users so if i go here and i check the stable users you can see coder steve has registered and he's referred no one at this point so this is coder steve's referral link so he's going to give this out as such. So I'll paste it into here. Paste Coder Steve and hit enter. Now you can see my referral link, referral URL is there. So now we're going to register a new user under Coder Steve and someone called Bob is going to come along and register an account. Coder Steve was the referrer, as in here. This is my referral link. So they register and then they can log in as Bob and log into their account. Right, they have zero users. You see that? But if I click this, now Bob has registered, but his refer, he was referred by Coder Steve. So now we need to add another one. You can you could probably change this, edit and update it. You could configure it to work a different way, but for this this quick little tutorial, I've just made it uh, work an easy way. So if we get Bob's referral link, and Bob's gonna give his referral link out. Now Bob has created his page, it looks like this. So after Bob, we've got Pete. Pete's gonna, um, Pete's gonna register now using Bob's referral link, register an account. So Pete's registered under Bob. So we've got Pete here, but his referrer is called Bob. So now if we log in as Pete and 
let's have a look and uh pete logging as pete and there you go pete ain't got anything in his so if we go back to log out and go to the login system .php main page and now if i log in as coder steve we'll have a little look at what we can do so we're logging as coder steve and you can see here i have changed it it says coder steve has referred one user because that's me i've only referred bob and let's have a look at bob so here is your own referral link you have referred one user the user you have referred are bob so i've created a hyperlink and the bob just like that and i'll show you the bit of code in the file and it's just here see this user.php question mark id equals row id equals ref username so i've had to create a new file called user.php which i'll show you in a minute but that's the bit of code change there quite literally so we'll click bob and this is what it says here you can view the users bob has referred now you can see bob has also referred pete you see that so this is a start for a multi-level marketing referral system if you click pete pete ain't referred anyone at, at this stage so if we go back to pete so if we go back to the account and i log out go back and go to the login system .php and i log in with pete like that and we'll get pete's referral link paste it in the top here so put pete in now we're going to make a new user register called john so we've got pete this is pete's referral thing so john can register now underneath pete so we register so he uh john john registered and john can log in do that so now john's got a referral link if we log out go back and go to the login system login system.php and we log back in as coder steve now we can see coder steve log back in right so coder steve it says you have referred one user you could say that you have referred one main user and then you could um run a separate query so doing stats for bob he can view the, the users bob has re uh, referred then he can click pete he can view the users pete has referred and then you can click john and john's referred no one so that's how you can create a downline as such it's um it could it, it's not 100 percent perfect but it works you just need to edit the code to work out how much you would like to give credit for each referral there's ways of there's all different ways of doing this so if i show you the last bit of the code it's the user.php this is the last bit of the file it's quite literally i hate it's a bit of code up the top here you've got the session you've got the connection the id you get in the id because in here logged in id equals row id so you're using a get to get the current id of that user then you're selecting all from the users table where id equals id and then you're getting the row username then down here further you're running a mysql i query again selecting all from users where refer equals username total and then down here refer username and it's given the username again to carry on this html is similar to the logged in system html it's just i've edited edited it a little bit so it just it don't really show uh that much it just shows this little box like this it don't show all the other stuff underneath all the other tutorials that we've that we've been doing recently so that's how your your refer um peer level can work 
any questions or comments please comment in the box below if you like my video please give it a thumbs up and if you want to subscribe subscribe to my channel because i release new coding tutorials uh, quite often so thanks again for watching my video hope you enjoyed